Just say, brother, yeah, brother, you, you. The Bible says, don't undermine the beginning of things. Okay. Oh, you hear me? Yes, man, of course. I'm talking about the issue of properties. Yes, sir. The selling of houses. Yes, man, of God. Oh, you hear me? Yes, sir. Because I saw you trying to sell houses, but some of them is like the old houses. Yeah. You hear me? Yes, sir. This, I want you to, to pray more because God can lift you up with, because of this. Yes, sir. Oh, you hear me? Thank you, Jesus. It, it looks like it's something very small. Some people can undermine it. God can give you this business, property business. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. And I believe God will do it. Thank you, Jesus. I believe God will do it. Come here. It was most of the house, but they're in Pretoria site. Yes. Huh? Yes. Tapa. It's free. Mama. Viewers all over the world, welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Sunday life service under the leadership of Apostle J.B. and Prophetess T. E. Makananisa. And with me here today is my brother who received a prophecy from Prophet Andres Simono. Sir, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Pesima Kubele. I'm from Pretoria. Today you are located by Prophet Andres Simono. Please tell us in detail what the man of God said to you and please confirm. Yeah, what he said is very true because I've been trying to do the business of selling properties and I've been struggling somehow, but today I believe I have received the grace enough to carry on with my business. And how do you feel that today the man of God located you and spoke to you regarding what you've been desiring? I felt so powerful because even when he speak, even he come near me, I realized that there was something that was hindering my business but today I thank God of Charis for the grace I thank him for locating me I thank him that from now on I believe things will move forward now Amen. and what words of encouragement do you have for somebody who's currently watching this I could encourage uh, viewers wherever they are watching us from they can partake in this grace and come to the house of God because even me where I'm staying is a bit far but by the grace I have to find myself in the house of God for me to partake in the grace. So I encourage you viewers, wherever you are, you can make that sacrifices, find yourself in the house of the Lord so that you may be delivered for your, for your career, for your assignment and for whatever you want to do in the future. In Jesus' name.